Hi, my name is Alex, and this is a tutorial on how to use the Regal Save Cleaner to clean up your Sims 3 saves. Just go ahead and open it. Now, once in here, you'll see that there's two things that I have here. One of these is my main save, and then one of these is my backup. It's recommended by other Simmers that you always try to do save as instead of overwriting your current save. I'm not 100% sure why myself. It's just something that I've always seen recommended, so I try to do it as well. Um, but I don't like to hold on to all of the extra ones because that can bog down your game. It's, yeah. So what I can do here is I'll select this. And you'll see when it's selected, it has that little bar on top. Just the little things. And then move to spare folder. Now, this isn't going to delete it from your computer, or it's just going to remove it from your Sim 3 file and move it to a completely separate file on your computer. So that's no longer here. Now we have my main save. So click on that and let's see what, I'm going to show you guys what cleaning options we have. So family portraits, portraits of Sims, lot thumbnails. These are just going to be removing the little preview images you have in your game. So for example, when you boot up to your main select menu and you're selecting a save, if you remove lot thumbnails, it's going to show up with a little default empty thumbnail, um, which it really isn't a big deal. It will regenerate a new one eventually. It's good to clear these out. Removing photos and removing generated images, you might want to be a little bit more cautious with these as these are going to be removing things like selfies, your Sims take in game, things like that. Um, removing textures and other types, I haven't messed with yet. The giant yellow experimental next to it is just kind of like, I'm just going to avoid that. So click on those. Now, here we have the option to create a backup, which I'm not going to do right now, but you can do that. And then your cache. These are pretty much all safe to do. These aren't going to affect anything in your game at all. So you're going to want to make sure you have all those checked. And then just start cleaning. It's pretty fast, all done. And you can see that it reduced my file size by pretty much a megabyte. So. Yeah, that's it. If you have any questions, feel free to comment them below. Uh, happy sending.